Before I say that, I want to commend you. I, I know you for too long, we have been together, and I know what you can do. So when I started reading the reports of what you have started doing already, I'm not surprised. I want to commend you on the effort you're making to save costs and develop by a state. Uh, you know, as I shared with you a few days before your election, you know, it's God that gives power and he has brought you for a time like this that by are looking forward. And I want you to remain focused as you've always been and trust in him because with God all things are possible. You know, uh, I believe that he brought you at a time like this to stabilize by a state. We owe you our prayers and our sincere love always. The Lord Almighty is you to Jesus' name. Amen. Your Excellency, um, Baesa, of course, they are going to make history as usual. You know, Mr. President had said that we have to uh, commence a pilgrimage twice in a year, and that will be during Easter and then the month of October till December. And uh, as God would have it, we are now commencing with the Baesans that could not go for the last pilgrimage exercise. So we are trusting God that this Easter period on the 25th of March, the first set of Baesans will leave Nigeria to Rome and from Rome to Israel. And we have come to, uh, we declare this planning open tomorrow before I go back to Abuja uh, to join his message to Benue. So I believe that it will give you an opportunity to speak to them. I know, uh, I know your reservations for pilgrimage programs, but I also believe that uh, since you are determined to develop the state physically. You also need to, to develop the human beings morally and spiritually so that they can understand the focus of your administration. Because without people being prepared spiritually to help you, you see that only you will be doing the work. And we know what the Bible says concerning pilgrimage, as is written in Zechariah chapter 8 from 22 to 24. The Bible made it clear that many nations, of course including Nigeria, they shall come to Jerusalem and pray and they shall be blessed. And many people have gone and come back with testimonies. Ours is a spiritual pilgrimage. Uh, I would work with you to ensure all those that have gone in the past will never give them the opportunity. Let's set a new standard where the poor people, those who are spiritually rich but materially poor, are given the privilege of going to pray for you, pray for the state, and join hands with you to move this state forward. Uh, I wouldn't want to allow the pilgrimage to be like a jamboree which people perceived in the past. This time around, we are bent on the spiritual aspect of this pilgrimage. And that's why we are partnering with the Christian Association of Nigeria by a chapter to ensure that Christians that are genuine and that have good moral standards are given the privilege of going. And I encourage you, sir, to work with them. Even at the national level, Mr. President also is working with the camp president, who, of course, is the, uh, the leader of the federal government delegation and also be the state uh, leaders to enable the government to be able to reach to the Christians because can is together under that umbrella. So we are working with them and uh, ask them to come and clear them because we don't have time. I pleaded with the Italian ambassador this afternoon that he should give us the benefit of that team. Money is the date and we cannot afford to delay them any longer. We gave you the time because we know you are settling down. So I want to appeal to you, sir. Whatever it will take to enable you make this one a success, we will appreciate that. And I will also invite you during the flag of where you will address them before they take off to the Holy Land. And uh, uh, this is the first state that we are commencing this pilot scheme with. I think Mr. President is very happy. He's from his state. Other state that we joined we include uh, Plateau and Anambra. These are the three states that we are starting this pilot scheme with. They are all ready. So we are just waiting for our BIOSA team. So, Your Excellency, uh, uh, on behalf of the Commission, we want to assure you of our sincere prayers and uh, we're going to work with the board. I thank God for, for the good